The woman had an issue of blood for 12 years. And the daughter was 12 years of age. So when she begins her illness, the child is born. Somebody missed that. Somebody missed that. There's a connection here. There's a connection. 12 years ago, she got sick. 12 years ago, she was born. And Jesus takes, hallelujah, his Holy Ghost power to not only deliver a malady, but to heal and raise the dead. In other words, he's good for whatever ails you. It's all about the touch. Unclean, unclean. But that day when she decided to do some, you know, serious movement, instead of her being obedient to law, she sought the Lord. To all the Pharisees in the house who are tied and committed to law. Don't let the law rob you of the visit of the Lord. The Lord wants to do something for you which may not even be in accordance with the law. Because if the law was upheld, most of us in this room wouldn't be sitting here today. But the Lord's grace and mercy always trumps fact fact is hallelujah you and I hallelujah shouldn't be standing here today but faith we've come this far by faith he had just been touched but now he's gonna touch It's all about the touch. I know I'm talking to today. But some of us in this room need a touch from the Lord. Preacher, what are you, what are you talking about? You preachers can get so subliminal and you can always get, you know, euphoric in your designs. Well, what I'm trying to tell you is... <laughs> You need a touch from the Lord. Wow. A preacher, I've never been touched by the Lord. Well, let's start there. In your immaturity as a believer or your carnality as a sinner, You don't know what a touch is. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. You've been touched. He touched you with his finger of love and woke you up this morning. That's a touch. He reigns on the just as well as the unjust. You've been touched. Now, the problem is whether or not you're mature enough or spiritual enough to know that it was a touch from him. I got a cloud of witnesses in this room that can testify about God's touch. Now, God's touch comes in this form. It either comes in interference, it either comes in intervention, it either comes in intercession, Do I have any witnesses that can testify that God will intervene? Anybody can testify here run interference? 
I, I, I know there's another crowd here that can testify. He'll even do interruption. No gimmicks. But the power of the Holy Spirit can interrupt, intervene, intercede in your situation. Father God, right now in the name of Jesus, as we prepare to touch, oh, bless the people of God. You know what they stand in need of. Oh, hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Bless the business. Bless the family. Bless the home. God, right now in the name of Jesus, run in the intervene, interrupt, whatever needs to do. Grant him success. Bless his hands. May everything that his hands touch prosper.